Hey guys, this is Mr. Crayfish, and welcome back to another modding tutorial. So in the previous tutorial, I showed you guys how to add the render to your armor. In this tutorial today, I'm going to be teaching you guys how to add the recipes. Now, I thought I would do this because probably a couple of you guys are going to be like, how do I do the recipes? How do I make them like the vanilla ones? So I'm just going to show you anyway, but if you guys know what you're doing, you don't really have to watch this. You can do it yourself, but I'm just going to be doing it anyway. So let's go ahead and what we're going to do is we're going to go into the initialization method here where the other uh, recipes are. And what we're going to do is type in game, registry, should know what you're doing here, add recipe, and then we'll do new item stack, and then put in our um, item armor up here. So we got the cheese helmet, so we'll copy that cheese helmet there, put it inside those brackets. And then for the params here, we'll do a new object, square brackets, open squiggly brackets, and at the end put a semicolon. Then we're going to put quotations, three quotations inside of the squiggly brackets there. Then we're just going to put it on a new line, just so it's visually nicer for you guys. Oops. So the helmet shape is quite simple, and if you guys know the vanilla one, it's three across the top, then we've got two below the end ones. So how that goes is we're going to do CCC, so that's the top part of the helmet, then we've got C space C. Now we haven't got anything at the bottom here, and what we can simply do is actually delete that, and we'll bring that back up to this first line here, or this second line, and then leave that comma there, we'll do space, single quotations and then simply define your material so C equals um, item cheese so there we go now I'm actually going to change that and make it cooked cheese because I want um, in the next tutorial we're going to be looking at ores and I want um, just plain cheese to be dropped by a block now let's do that again and we're just going to do gain registry dot add recipe new item stack and then put cheese or oh, cheese chest I think it's cheese cheese chest plate and then params should know what you're doing here squiggly brackets semicolon at the end so put in your three quotations we're going to need three of them for the chest plate so the chest plate goes C space C then for the second one we got C C C and for the last one, we've got CCC. Oopsie, not four Cs, three Cs. And just to make it look visually better, you can see the shape of the chest plate like that. So we got um, just basically it's full except for this top middle one here. Then we'll define what C is. So C is going to be item cooked cheese. Pretty simple. Now I've just skipped this, but you guys should know what you're doing. Just basically do that again, but put in cheese leggings. Then the, the shape of these is CCC for the first one. The second one is C space C, and then the last one is C space C. Then just simply define what C is. Now the boots, we only need two, so don't worry about creating three quotations. Now just again, more visually... Um, better for you guys. So uh, boots is C space C, and then the second one is C space C. Then after that, comma, define what C is, and then type in item cooked cheese. So there we go, we have defined our recipes or our crafting recipes for the armor. We're just gonna shit, we're gonna not, wow, we're gonna hit control shift F, and then go ahead, make sure you press your save button. And then we're going to go ahead and run the game. And we've got our crafting bench here with our grilled cheese. And what we're going to do is going to create each shape. For the, so the helmet is like that. So we've got our cheese helmet. Our chest plate is that shape. Get our chest plate. Our leggings are that shape. And then finally our boots. We can do it in that shape. So there we go guys. That is the end of the tutorial. Let's put this stuff on just for fun. Got my cheese armor. That is so epic. I really like the look of it. It's just cheesy. I might put some holes in it as well. Um, I might do that just in my own time. So hopefully you guys enjoyed. Um, and in the next episode, we're going to be going over all generations. So you can actually have some sort of way to get the cheese or whatever you're creating in your... Um, 
whatever you are creating in your mod. Now, I'd like you guys to add two sets of armor into your mod. That would be cool. And that's just a cool little task I'm giving you guys right now. So add two sets of armor into your mod. And I will see you guys for the next one. Bye-bye.